I've got with us modern faces once again here at Strawberry Field. Woo! Good to be back. It is. It's good to be back. It's good to see you guys. What, it's been almost a year since I've seen you all. What have you been up to? Nothing really. Just gigging, mostly. Gigging, mostly. Gigging? Like, <laughs> like a lot of gigging. A lot of gigs. Okay, and not you've been supporting no, some not pretty no. amazing bands as well, well, haven't you? We supported Kasabian when we last time we seen you. Yeah. Since then we supported Charlatans, Twine, the Rifles. Yeah. This is yes, so okay. pretty busy year, the okay. last 12 months. And um, <laughs> over the last 12 months, we here at Lightswitch have managed to get two more microphones. So, are you That's happy well, with that? Well, I heard you're moving up, man. You're totally moving up. You're moving up. I'm up this six foot. Dude, you've got two microphones. It's amazing. <laughs> We've really upped our game since then. So he got a, a proper answer now, yeah. right? Okay. He's just taking out for the weekend. He gets returned on Monday. <laughs> Don't worry about him. Oh yeah. No, just just what we've had experience in the last year, like we said, we've had a busy year, and obviously matured a lot and been a lot of places, seen a lot of things that a lot of people don't get to see. So hopefully we can write it in tunes and relate to people. That's that's the aim. Number one aim is to relate to the people. Yeah. That buy our music, and if we can do that, we're getting the, we're doing something right. So that's just more of the same. And jazz fusion. And um, you've toured with some incredible bands, obviously, Kasabi and the Charlatans. Like, what's been the highlight of that for you guys? The last twelve, well, obviously our highlight, ultimate highlight is Kasabian. The Kasabian, the first night we done with them at Sheffield was was unreal. You know what I mean? We always hold that close in our hearts. But last sort of twelve months, it's sort of been we just kicked off our sort of warm up dates, and uh, the first one we done. It was sold out in Manchester, well out of our country, you know what I mean? And it was just yeah. mega, just to see those people all there to see you and yeah. you know, chanting your songs back to you. You feel appreciated, so hopefully that means we're going on to a big tour and it's yeah. going to be a major success, man. And are you looking forward to just touring on your own as well? Yeah, yeah, man. I mean, you learn, you know, going on tour with people, it's all about stealing their fans. Yeah. So that's what it's about. <laughs> so we steal their fans and uh, learn from them. I mean, they've been there, done it, so... We feel like we're ready to take it up a notch and move on ourselves. Yep. So let's go. That's time to go. And what's the part of your forthcoming tour that you're most looking forward to? Where are you most looking forward to playing? All of it. All of it. All yeah. of it. All of it. We love being in that tour bus for six hours driving down south. <laughs> Can't beat it. Can't beat it. <laughs> and um, what's what's the worst thing about touring with Modern Faces? Shields. What's that? He's driving. <laughs> He's driving. Well, that's probably me. They all sit in the back and enjoy themselves after sitting in the front and entertain him while he's driving. <laughs> well, the banter's rife in the front, like, Jesus Christ, cut the stand-ups. <laughs> it sounds hilarious. Well, guys, thanks so much for chatting to us and uh, good luck with the rest of the tour. Enjoy. Thank you much for your Thank time. You. Cheers. Right. Cheers. Cheers.